Here's Perkins from downtown. The Maroon. And St. Joseph's is controlling the opening tip here. And they've lost three in a row, but most recently at UMass on Wednesday, they had their second best shooting effort of the entire season, but still lost by 15 points. And I think that's a great strategy. 10 nothing run now for the Hawks. Javante Perkins trying to get inside, and he'll go Saturday night at home in conference, making a couple of shots early. Look, they're going to bring out the best or the worst of us, and I think right now they're bringing out the best. Defense every possession. They want to encourage outside shots, but now they got a rebound. Offensive rebound by Javante. Daly tries to kick it out, and he turns it over. Perkins leading the three on two. And Javante Perkins is fouled. Plays on his behalf. I think a lot of it has to do with the minutes he plays. He really doesn't get much of a rest. Adjustments, and again, <laughs> if you're Travis Ford, this is... Where's the St. Louis confidence going to come from? <laughs> it's a good question. It's going to have to be getting stops. And, and you know, how far they have been capable of. Anthony Longpre was called for his first personal. Javante Perkins here at the free throw line. Game. They found ways to win most of this year. They do, and he makes them pay. St. Joseph's fourth in the nation in three-point attempts per game this season. They hoist a lot of shots from downtown. Javante Perkins. They're going to try to take him away, and they have. But he's letting his teammates do the work. Hawks by two. Javante Perkins goes glass with a nice crap. Long prey. Coming up short on the three-point attempt. Coming up on the midpoint of our second half. Three-point St. Joseph's lead. Javante Perkins. Travis Ford is not happy. He's going to make a substitution. He just cannot watch Ryan Daly get to the rim at will. And by the way, then you're going to get some wins and some, and some credit for beating teams in the league. There's Javante Perkins getting his own rebound and putting it back in. Seeing two of 15 free throw attempts here this evening. A team that shoots 70% collectively from the line. And now with 20 points on the night. Here's Perkins from downtown. Here late. Well, if you're St. Joe's, you have got to pay attention to Perkins. I don't think anybody else is going to get my attention as much as Javante Perkins. Here he is now against two defenders absorbing the contest. Second leading score on this team, averaging 12 per game, shooting free throws because they don't make it at a high enough percentage. So they give it to Perkins. Playing, you know, was encouraging his team. He said, look, I got to stay positive with my guys. Their efforts there. And there is no question, it is. And you don't want to tear down the morale. They've been playing hard, and that's hard to do sometimes when you have a losing record. Won't be happy with the turnover numbers tonight. No. 15 for the Hawks now. Goodwin for a wide open Perkins. Tough turnovers for the Billikens here tonight. And that was one of the large, led a much better free throw shooting effort. He's been at the line more than any other player. Tons of these, trust me. This clock never moves fast enough. Javante Perkins has to let it fly. Big rebound by Jordan Goodwin. Shot clock resetting. Now, for those of you tuning in looking for Monster Energy Supercross from Oakland, that will start on the NBC Sports app at 8.30 p.m. Eastern. And we'll have that for you live here on NBCSN at the conclusion of this game. Three to shoot. Perkins going down hard. Three-point game. <laughs> 11 of 12. Daly against French for his seventh three off the mark. Yuri Collins will pull up. They get it to Perkins. That's the man they wanted to advantage. Thirty-three points.